Would you sacrifice your car for a dying man? What? Mm. Do I know? Well, do why I know are you? Man? Why are you questioning that, Carrie? Well, would what you? you would you sacrifice? get the? Like, would you? Like, would you get the car like, back after he's? No, uh, like, like it's a fucking like it's a fire. You're parked in the red, and there's like a fire truck, and they only way they can oh, do it is if wrong, fucking yeah. Bumblebee comes and fucking chucks your car across the world. You just <laughs> said save a fucking person's life. How did that go to fucking Bumblebee? Well, fucking obviously, fire trucks are fucking awesome Optimus dead. Prime. Optimus Prime's no, not, not a fire, fire truck. truck. Nah, he's a yeah, semi. bro, he's semi. Yeah, he's a semi. Yeah, he's a yeah. fake fan. With, with red flames on it. Wait, did you guys watch that new Bumblebee movie? Flag. I didn't. No, I didn't. You did? With yeah. that girl? What's uh, her face? Haley Seinfeld? Yeah. I don't know why I know her name. I was watching it at the auto yeah. shop. I was you know waiting. Haley Seinfeld? I don't know everyone's name. Haley Seinfeld? Is it Seinfeld or Seinfeld? Seinfeld? Seinfeld. Seinfeld. Y'all ever Seinfeld. watch Seinfeld? No. Yeah. I, my parents no. fucking love bit. that show, though. Dude, that's my stepdad's favorite show. It's the worst it's show right. ever. Really? It's the worst show ever. It's not funny. He knows, like, Luke, what did you just do? Every word to every episode. <laughs> did he spill? Did he spill? Nah, nah. How many times are you gonna spill in this house, bro? Nah, I spilled all. Someone spilled in front of the fridge. And then all right, let's out. start this podcast. Someone fucking, someone fucking used all their strength let's, to push a fucking five eight kid, let's, and let's he start, spilled all the crown royal all yeah, over the fucking floor. Tough, crown bro. royal. It's that's really crown tough, royale. bro. You really? Just, <laughs> like, oh no! Let's start the podcast. It's not. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> and we're live in three. <laughs> Two, one. <laughs> Dude, what did you do? What Wait, did you Car- do? Crown Royale is the video game, right? <laughs> what? No, <laughs> no. What did she just say? <laughs> she talking about Smash Bros. <laughs> no, 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 she's dying. Clash Wait. Clan. <laughs> Shit. No, she's talking about Clash Royale, you fucking idiot! Oh. <laughs> Crown Royale. He said Smash Bros. Oh, Where do you get Smash Bros. from Crown Royale? She said video game. I don't consider Clash Royale a video game. It is. Or Clash Royale is a video game. What the fuck is Clash Royale? Phones. It's a. Okay, we're getting. It's out. a. A board game. It's an app. And we're live in three, two, one. Hello, <laughs> gentlemen, and welcome back to another segment <laughs> of Suburb Talks. I'm your host Nick Rahetta. Joining me tonight we have <laughs> Daniel Fabris. What's up? Luke spilled. What did you spill? Bro? I heard. I heard no, him I, say I, it's I all sp- wet. I ain't spilling. I know. I know. What'd you spill? What'd you spill? No, this is this is this okay, is a whole man. You spilled like like a fifth of my water. <laughs> you spilled a a fifth of the <laughs> whole yes. cup. No, no, I only filled. It was only like halfway, so it's not that much. Step on it. Is it wet in your sock? No, no. no. It's not. It's, 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 it's not wet on his sock, bro. What'd you say? It's not wet on his sock. <laughs> Sounds like sock. <laughs> Daniel Fabris. What's good? <laughs> Cynthia Choi. Hi. Lucas Osazawa. Hello. Owen Miller. What's up? And Carrie Martin. What's up, guys? First off, guys, I do want to start by saying that Daniel has taken the crown as the most sus person in the group. Why? <laughs> Last week, why? last week, Daniel, I came home. Wait, I'll tell you, no, no, that was a good question. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. Last right, week, I came you. home and Daniel was sleeping in his room. And then he comes out the room and he was like, bro, what would you do if you just like came home and you heard me getting clapped? Valid question. Sorry, what? He, Why'd you, you say heard, like that? You heard him getting no, clapped? No, he, he, uh, he, came, he came out of the room and he was like, bro, what would you do if you just like came home and you heard me getting clapped? Heard how, him how would you know? Him how clapped. would you know it's him though? Like, don't ask me. Well, why can it be like him clapping someone else? Well, like, don't you know, ask, that's when what you're he getting asked clapped. Me. You're like moaning and stuff. So, <laughs> but so you're, you're saying like, like you know, ooh. you know his moans then? No, he asked like the it. question. He asked the question. Yeah. He's taking it out of he takes moan. everything out of context. I think you asked too. I want to know what you asked. He came home originally, and he didn't think I was home. He's like scream, and I screamed, and he got scared. So I walked out and was like, yo. What if you just came home and I was getting clapped? Like, but I meant like getting killed. Oh, well, I mean. <laughs> when have you ever heard someone say like, yeah, why uh, getting <laughs> clapped doesn't get killed? Why are Thank you lying? You, Luke. Thank why are you, you lying? Bro, if I'm was clapped, it Daniel saying yeah. it? Was it Daniel saying it? I say it. If, if I'm, I'm playing being, COD and I yeah. quick scope this dude on my eyes clapped, this okay, kid that's, clapped. Okay, okay. <laughs> no, but like, you're really yeah, like, like, bro. Thank you, bro. Great example right there. I just clapped this kid, bro. Bro, that was a great example right there, actually. That was a great example. But if someone got. Hold on, hold on. You're referring to clapping their cheeks. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank, right? thank, thank you. Yeah, well, thank that's you, true. Out. That's what he's referring to getting stabbed. What? That's different. Well, because he you just clapped my cheeks. <laughs> you have, we have never. <laughs> <laughs> you clapped your cheeks. You took your fucking life. Exactly, bro. <laughs> you got clapped. Exactly. So wet. It's different, dude. <laughs> what did you? How much did you actually spill? My pants are covered in water. Are they actually? Yeah, yeah. They're like two different colors. Stand up. No. Stand up. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this part out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> is it a fifth? Why do you always spill? That's not a fifth. That ain't no fifth, bro. <laughs> That's half. Yeah. It sounded like you were pouring pants? another glass. The did you, it was like falling. Did you hear it? Like, it was like. 
Yeah, dude. <laughs> I look up, he's like, whoa. Hey, oh. <laughs> it played it off pretty well, though. Mm. Anyways, though, also, yeah. guys, uh, for those of you asking on TikTok about um, a podcast that we did that I'm not posting on YouTube, um, we all got together and we all decided that we were going to talk about our feelings on a podcast, you know, open up, um, have a couple <laughs> drinks, stuff like that. And it turned out to be a complete disaster. And about an hour and a half can't be used. And 10 minutes probably could. No. So probably not even yeah, 10 minutes. How much do no. you think can be used? Like a minute. You think you'd say a minute? No, a little longer than a minute. I think like, like 10 but it's minutes. like clips. It's like five seconds here. <laughs> yeah. Definitely like not. 10. Towards the end, we just started talking about stuff that should not be put in a video. I feel like it would, yeah, I'll be like yeah. censored. Yeah, yeah, everything. Yeah. <laughs> That's like so. It's, a, it's just Nick like talking. He has a bleep over his mouth for like two minutes. <laughs> like, wow. I could post it all, but there'd like the be definitely story. long intervals yeah. of just bleeped out or like just quiet. Can't post it, bro. Yeah. yeah. No, but yeah, for those of you asking on TikTok, um, little clips will be posted, but it's not getting posted on YouTube. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, it was Stays a really bad idea. Archives. You look fucking sick, Owen. I feel sick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and uh, get the night started. I actually have a couple questions that the people want to know that I actually thought were kind of funny. First off, to start the night, one of the people wanted to know, Owen, how do you start off a conversation with a girl? <laughs> I, I, I actually got a lot of these. I actually got a lot of questions. Like, what would you do? You have like a go to, like, hey, how you doing? Nah. How Usually. <laughs> you gotta start with a compliment, right? Mm -hmm. And then do it on me. Do it on me. Let no. him. Let him finish. Come on, let him finish. Come on, no, let I want to see him in I'll, action. Let him finish. Why not? Because I'm gonna tell you how I do it. Okay, fine. And then, <laughs> and then do it on me. <laughs> Nixon be like, <laughs> "This is why I should have hey, a notepad." You hit them with the compliment, and then you walk <laughs> away. You walk away. Well, it depends. It depends where I'm at. It depends. Wait, hold up. Is that usually why you like talk to girls and then you go sit in the corner by yourself? Man, you're funny, bro. You're Wait, so is that, is that honestly, wow. if you're like out somewhere, if you compliment a girl like early in the night and then you just like walk away and like you leave it like that, that leaves like, I don't know. I feel like it leaves like a, a window open for her to come over to talk to you or like, I don't know. Like you bump into each other again. Uh, you're like, yeah. hey, you're the guy that likes my necklace. Yeah. <laughs> And you you're start like, combo. You're like, no, it was your earrings, but um, <laughs> you, you forgot, huh? You got that too much. Right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Would you compliment some girl's jewelry? No. Yeah. You would? Yeah. She got a sick old chain. I'll be like, she had a big old. <laughs> she had a big old padding chain. on her. Wrist. That lot of necklace. I'll be like, yeah. That's why I tell her straight up that she has a lot of necklace. Mm -hmm. well, what so if she if she gets the joke? If she gets the joke, that'd be funny as fuck. But what if she doesn't get the joke? Win win. She she ain't the one then. Been sipping on damn fucking Mexican pita like. <laughs> <laughs> Mexican Pedialyte? You can try it? Nah. It's fine. Can I try it? Mm -mm. Okay. No, honestly, <laughs> I go I go okay. in like guns a blazing. Like, you just got to do it. But but know? what do you mean? You mean just like go in and start a conversation or do you actually do the comment and then walk away? No, I never. No, I would never like just give a compliment and walk away. If I was like out somewhere and it was like a girl that I found really attractive and I wanted to talk to her, why would I walk away? Why would you, Carrie? Never see her again. What? Why? Why would you? Why would you just walk away? I was just kidding. About oh, that. I okay, okay. Yeah. Right. Actually, right. that's definitely a lie because I've definitely like, we were on a podcast like one of our first ones, and Carrie's like, "Plant the seeds, dude. <laughs> Plant the seeds before, man. Yeah. Then you let them fertilize." That's <laughs> true. Like, you, <laughs> how long does it take for them to fertilize though for you? Usually, I have no recollection. On that. I yeah. think I remember I what you're talking about. Okay, I remember that podcast. Sure, yeah. I have no recollection on that. Mm. Mm. Definitely. Can, not. can you just be saying shit at this point? You got a point. What? Well, it's like oh um, well, like it's planting the seed. Yeah, yeah. You're just talking. is though. Yeah. So you, so you did say that. It doesn't have to happen right away, you know. Like you, over a span of time, you know, you plant the seed. And, and then you wait for her to come to you, or like when you um, know the right time. If, to if go you talk think to her. right, you you'll know when the right time is the right time. You know. Does that work? <laughs> Does that work? Would you say? If they walked away. If they came, commented some something about you, and then or walked away. Or just talk with you for a little bit, and then walk away. It would work because like. Yeah, like like you said, if you bump into them later, you can like, you know each other already. Yeah, exactly. Off a compliment. Yeah, but if you compliment her and you walk away, like how do you know how I'm not, like, like she okay. reacted to it? We're like, not just know, complimenting and walking like, away here. Not. We're not just so doing that. Bro. Going back to her is like a fifty-fifty. You know? If you're doing that, you're you're just straight up stupid. I'm sorry. I don't know. I think you just uh, <laughs> you just roll your dice right there. If she likes it. You keep going, and then if she doesn't, what if she just hits you? Away. What if she just hits you with a thank you? Like thank, oh my god, thank you. Mm. 
Is that like a closed door right there? You gotta have emotional intelligence. That's when you know he's like, nope. Yeah, emotional right. Emotional intelligence. So, so it, she would. If used you to be like called emotional quotients. Yep. Okay. Wait. Yeah. Would you wait? Would huh? you say? It used to be called emotional quotients, but now it's emotional te- intelligence. Emotional quotients. Yeah. What What's quotients mean? Isn't that how the to solve a, a division problem? Quotients. <laughs> Quotients means like it's like isn't, it, isn't the quotient oh, oh. Yeah, yeah but it, it, the, it, answer, it, it, the answer to the answer division problem it has like a non mathematical meaning I don't what know is, what does quotient mean then it's something like that <laughs> <laughs> so what's the emotional quotients it's basically what emotional intelligence is it's like, I'm pretty sure it's just like having like being aware and, so and being knowledgeable answers. I don't know but I'm gonna start using that one though emotional quotients yeah, it sounds sick <laughs> it does sound sick yeah. but um oh. yeah if a guy comes up to you and comments you and you kind of just hit him with a thank you. Does that kind of like close the door? Yeah. Oh, hey, nice. Like if I'm honestly, if I'm just like standing there and he comes up and talks to me, like I can't escape, you know, so I'm probably going to engage in the conversation. Oh, even so if I'm into him or not. If you're not into him. Yeah. But like if we're just like walking by and like he gives me a compliment, I'm not going to like stop and like talk to him unless I'm into him. Wow. That guy was hot. You know, like, <laughs> damn. Yeah. So if a guy passes, <laughs> if a guy, if a guy passes by and is like comments, he's like, "Hey, I really I like your nose." Happened. Would you stop? Yeah. And be like, "Oh my god, like I like whatever part of you too." First of all, that's I, a like weird a, ass compliment. I feel like that's what a lot of people. I, I feel like if you're a girl, you gotta yeah, be a weird. I feel like if you're a girl, you gotta be about it to like snap back, right? Like, yeah. I, can, yeah. I feel like because you're caught off guard. Like that, yeah, you, right? that happened to me. Somebody was like, "Oh, like I really like your hair or some shit." I'd be yeah. like, I'd, li- I'd just be like. <laughs> yeah. No, that's how it is, bro. Yeah. When when I'm at like uh, when someone comments my hair, I'm just like, oh, thank you. I fucking walk away or like I run away. And, or I like look at him for like two seconds and I'm like, <laughs> if I don't think of anything, I'm all, I'm gone. I'm like, oh, yeah, it's like quick you. at the first glance, you know, and you're like, oh, thank you, and you walk away. So you're saying, oh, well, you said you're going guns blazing. Did that just mean you're starting a conversation off the bat? Uh, yeah, I'm shooting my shot right there. But what is shooting your shot though, bro? Like you just you commenting and you just stick into the conversation. Hey man, it's a tricky game. You mm-hmm. just gotta play around with it. So that's that's your answer to it. Di- honestly, like it depends where you are. You know, like a party versus a bar is different. Party versus or like a bar even versus just a like beach. yeah, like exactly. Next fucking question: What color toes are the best color? Dude, I think we're um, all gonna say the same color. Medium yeah. tapered, French tip. <laughs> 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 There's no way. Is that a thing? Is that a thing? No. Medium tapered? Yeah. Mid <laughs> mid taper. I don't fucking know. French tip is a I thing. Know. Square. Then like a square. Okay, that's a square thing. Really Perfectly right angled nails. French tips. Square. With nails? Did you get your nails done? With toenails. Yeah. Uh-huh. Never you seen them. Seen your nails? Uh. Not done right now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even uh. see them. <laughs> You're saying medium tapered French toenails? French. French. Wait, what is it? Fre- French tip. French it. French. French tip. <laughs> is your medium favorite? Medium tapered French tip. <laughs> <laughs> I love you be fucking with French tip toes though too. French tip is uh, what? The, what the fuck's a French tip? It's like it's when they have the, the little, white, the little white edge, bro. Yeah. Oh, nice. What's your favorite? You're probably something basic like white, huh? I'll do a nice like, like a nice burgundy. Mm. It's hard for me because I'm colorblind, so I only got so many <laughs> options. <laughs> Luke, are you really? No, I've, I've just been saying that for 14 years, Cynthia. I've never it, heard you say that till tonight, right now. Uh, I've heard it. I hear him say it at least once a week. Yeah, yeah. I like a maroon color too, bro. That's yeah. just nice. Wait, what's maroon to you though? Like that's maroon. That's like that's like burgundy. That's maroon. That's maroon. No. That's red. red. That's, that's red. maroon. That's red. This that's is closer. Red. Wait, how are you colorblind then? That's maroon. Bro. You just named all the colors. Uh, no, yeah, no, burgundy no, and maroon, maroon, maroon are super like. We've been over this so many times. What colors don't you see? I see colors. They're just different to me. It's like slightly different. And if they're like, t- together, I like can't tell the difference. This is red, it's Same. I'm red slightly colorblind. Him, but it might look. See, green. see Cynthia's beanie. See the pattern. Let's say they were made up of two colors, being red and green. That whole thing would just look like a mesh. Of, I, I couldn't differentiate like, like the certain color. patterns. I couldn't tell like this is where it stops. This is where it starts. It kind of just looks like a blob. So you were failing that eye exam in elementary school. Oh, bro, when <laughs> they when they when they put <laughs> the, the, numbers the number in, I literally thought they were like gave me drugs. Really? Because she's like, because after like it was an eight. I'm like, and I was I remember talking to Lady. I'm like, there's no <laughs> there's no number in here. And she's like, okay, okay. She's like, okay, next. I'm like, no, go back. Let me let me see it. <laughs> and like. It took me a while. I can see you doing that as a little kid. Too. <laughs> it took me a while to like understand that, because because it's especially when it comes to vision. Yeah, it's really hard to understand that it's just it's not normal or something. Because I feel like vision is so like surreal and it, it makes everything feel real. Obviously, yeah. So to yeah. me, I'm just like, 
you guys are crazy. <laughs> so yeah. Damn. Was that the first time your eyes lied to you? <laughs> oh yeah, and during Christmas time, I just start crying. When they put that tree up, bro, I'm just like looking at it. I'm like, <laughs> think about that. you know, red and green are actually opposite colors, so it's supposed to mess with your op- optic nerve. I thought it was red and blue. No, it's red and green. Oh, like on the color wheel? Yeah. Is it red and green? Because yeah. I'm taking so it, it's art blue and right orange. Now. Yeah. Yeah. It's What's yellow? Yellow and purple. 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 Yeah. Okay. So they're opposite colors. Yeah. It messes, and it's like in the same mm-hmm. general area. It's supposed to mess with. Your, Wait, like, for everyone or people who are? Uh, usually everyone. Like it, it messes with your optic nerve. It does ju- doesn't like it. I don't know. That's like, like the most common um color blindness. I don't know. What you you Col- title it. Yeah. yeah. It's red and green. Like in most common in men. Yeah. Men are usually more colorblind. That's why you're saying you're colorblind. Cause you can't see red and green. You can you see like other colors though? Like so, was your Christmas tree red? <laughs> like or what? Is what, it red? what? Yeah, we have a white Christmas tree at home. Damn, <laughs> oh, <laughs> hell yeah. yeah, they <laughs> flock it. You know? They changed yeah. it for they you. Flock it. No, we had one last year. Oh, it was but, cool. But not because you're colorblind and it hurt your eyes or anything, right? I or, mean, I didn't tell me anything. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever complain to your parents? Like, mom, like. Why is this Christmas tree fucked up? No, it was with the flow. So <laughs> you never told them. You were just like, I can't ruin their Christmas. Nah, this, this hope Santa got me Legos. <laughs> that works too, I yeah. guess. All right. Uh, okay. What color is your favorite toe? Dude, the other day I saw a girl <laughs> who had like these long ass green acrylics, like bright slime green. On the, her toes? Like, on her hell? hands and her toes. Uh, it was looking hard. Where were you at? I was at work. Uh, did you have to put, uh, put on shoes for her? Well, you see. Uh, no. Fuck that. Uh, no. I mean, were they kind of cool though? Like low key? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What's your favorite color toe, Carrie? <laughs> <laughs> Probably like white or black. And you know what's even better? If she got half white and half black. Uh, like, wait, like on every like other toe? Or yeah. like one foot, one whole foot white, one whole foot black? No. <laughs> like, like on a toenail, bro. Like, oh, half, like white and black? No, yeah. dude. Just wait, like, like on half. one okay. toenail? Like the Oreo yeah. toes, yeah. bro. <laughs> hey, Luke, what would you do if your girl got like red and green toes? Like, would you be able to see, like, would you be able to see them? <laughs> This little pig. Wait, which one? <laughs> <laughs> like, do, you whoa, think, whoa. do you think you'd be able to? Would it like like bother you if she got like red or green? Like probably. <laughs> oh no, let's chop them off. Oh no, bro. <laughs> I don't know. That's a that's a that's a weird question, man. Okay, next question. This one's for the guys that we can get to the podcast. If your homie sends you a dick pic, yo, and you screenshot it, who's more sus? Screenshot. 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 Yeah. Dick pic. I, you're, you're, <laughs> no, both. Why this is this dude on, on Snapchat? Yeah. On Snapchat yeah. It goes away. Why are you saying Why are you in the first place? Why is it's a lose lose place, situation. There's who's, no. There's, there's no got to be. There's got to be one person. No who's way. Yeah. They're, they're both sus, yeah. bro. Nah. Nah. I don't they're like both that question. Sus. Both That's, sus. Why are you sending a picture of your dick to your like, friend? What's the situation? Yeah. Who here? Who here has sent a picture of their dick to their friend? Not me. What the fuck? Did you really? No. Yeah, you did, bro. I did. Nick, you be on the weirdest shit here. Yeah, bro. Dude. I definitely have a picture of your dick in my phone. Okay, what if you send it on accident? Nah, let me tell a story. And then your friend nah. screenshots it. What? Do you what, are you gonna what are you going to say? What are you going to say? Bro, send bro, it me, to me and Nick oh. are in the Target fucking restroom, right? We're just chilling. Oh, yeah. I'm like, yo, I, okay, I need to go use the restroom, right? So Nick takes a picture <laughs> of me over the stall, and you see my, my thing... Like just no, you in, don't. In it, right? That's not your thing. That's that's not your thing. That's right? your fucking he po- shirt. He posted on his story, and like Damn. a couple people screenshotted it. And I'm like telling him, like, bro, like delete that. She's like, bro, you know how Nick is. The most yeah. stubborn. He's like, bro, no, it's not. It's content. No, bro. Yeah, he's trying to get content. It and, and it wasn't. It wasn't his. And actual, you literally see it. No, I I didn't want to no. pull it up because I don't want to show everybody. I'll pull it up. No, I still have it. Bro, yeah, I know you do because it's my shits in there. You weirdo. You Anyways. know it too, so why are you? Oh, you you to know die? it. You're, like, you're trying to lie. Okay, That's well, crazy. I was talking about another picture, but I have like five. Of Damn, so you have two pictures of Luke's dick? I have more than two. <sighs> Don't sleep here, bro. One time, my friend did like that same exact shit, but it was like at Sunny Hills. What? But like, you couldn't see his wiener. It was just like him <laughs> recording him. In like the stall, and he's like, oh, "Get out of here, bro!" Damn, that's fucked. Hey, yeah, that's one fucked kid up. at my school when I was in high school, sophomore year, was whacking the fucking stall, bro. Wait, as a joke or like? No, literally whacking it. Like his name, I, I know his name. Don't say not, it. Yeah, don't say it. Yeah, one of my football teammates, fucking pulls out the camera and fucking records him, and the whole school knows in like two hours, bro. Damn. Yeah. That's sad. That's fucked up. Yeah. What do you mean? Don't be wanking in at school. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't be recording dudes wanking at school. <laughs> True. Yeah. Who's who's really in the wrong? The kid wanking it or the kid recording him wanking? It was a both lose lose situation. No, okay, someone's got to be more in the wrong. Okay, it's a lose lose. <clears throat> Somebody loses a little less. But 
if there was no wanker, there couldn't be a no co- recorder. And if there was no picture, there couldn't be a no screenshot. I'll so tell you, I'll tell you. the guy in who says the situation dick- in the wanking situation, the guy <laughs> recording is in the wrong. In no, the, no, I don't think so. What if, if, dick what if I meant dick to send it to a girl? What if I meant to send it to a girl? It goes to my homie. He screen like screenshots it. Wait, I'm like, no, dude, somebody what the else fuck? is recording, right? What? Why would someone he, else recording is recording your dick. my dick pic? Wait, wait, wait. No, he, wait, what? Carrie no, she's said, talking about the bathroom. Okay. He's uh, talking about the bathroom. Situation. Oh, I thought we were talking about the dick pic still. We're talking about in both those situations, the kid recording that guy wanking it and the guy wanking it. Yeah. yeah Who's yeah. more sus? But I'm t- Okay, so I'm comparing the dick pic situation with this. Yes. The guy sending the dick pic is more sus, but the guy recording the guy wanking is more sus. I don't think so. I don't like these questions. <laughs> yeah, me either. This because is weird. I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How are we talking about people winking yeah. their dick? Yeah. We're sending dick pics, you know? You were the one who brought up the winking. <laughs> okay, but you're the one that brought up the dick yeah, pics. I don't <laughs> think, like, sending each other, like, dick pics is, like, a thing. Like, think if you did it on accident. <laughs> well, to Nick, it's supposedly a thing. <laughs> yeah. Is that someone like asked like me the question? Like he li- someone he asked me this question. He likes to like get in these questions. Someone, these weird ass questions. Someone bro. asked me this. You, you know, all these questions don't pertain to any of us. This is him trying to get it out of us. I know. What do you mean? Because you be sending them. You be bro. screenshotting. The, I've never once. Devil, I never once send you my fucking. Junk, He's a sociopath. That's a cap. I've never once sent it. To I feel sociopath. like I, you might catch me sending my balls one time. Yeah, exactly. Like, that could be funny. I yeah, my that can be funny. Hey, facts. <laughs> Be like, yo, I got a piece of gum stuck. See, that's funny. <laughs> that's Look funny. funny. Yeah. <laughs> Cynthia, he's like, fuck these idiots. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Do you get this humor? Like, does it make sense? Like, if you're a guy, would you ever like find that funny? If like one of your homies said, no. <laughs> I, I kind of find, find it a little funny. Balls are funny. I have balls are funny. <laughs> <laughs> that's <laughs> since Luke's getting a little bit uncomfortable over there. I'll go ahead and move it on. Would you say, Lucas, that a high body count is worse than, or what's more of a red flag, a high body count or a high relationship count? Body count. You say body counts. How would wait? How would you wear that? Like, which is worse or which is? Yeah. More of a red flag. Yeah, which one's more of a red flag? There's no red flag. It's not a red flag. How many relationships is it? Not. Yeah, it could be like two to one. Like ten. You know. Ten relationships or. 10. That's a lot. At the age, let's say at the age of 20. At the age of 20, and they've not 10, no way. Okay. 10's a lot. Yeah. At the age of 20, I know a kid who had 10. Actually, yeah, there's some that are close. So 10, because it's a lot. 10 at the age of 20? What's the the minimum amount of time for it to be considered a relationship? I I say like a year. That's why I'm like 10. (laughs) Wait. Nah. You could definitely be together with somebody for like six months, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Even like. Okay, back back to back. Let's say they're back to back. Let's just say they're all back to back relationships. Like no time in between. Oh, no. No, that's Would scary. you say I, I feel think like that's scary. I think the high relationship. That means that means scary. they got them lined up already. <sighs> yeah. Like some somebody's just like up up next to bat, you know. Oh, that's a good way to put it. That I think I think high relationship count then mm-hmm. would be more would be more of a red flag to me than a high body how, count. How high it, of a body count? Bro, I don't think either of them are a red flag. Then how would you word it? That's cap, bro. Which is There's no. That's a red flag, bro. A high, that's a, a to high, say uh, a red high, flag a to be like, oh, I shouldn't I shouldn't get into this. A high relationship count is a red flag. If she starts saying stuff like, oh, like, my ninth boyfriend, I'd be like, what? <laughs> like, that's my, a red flag. Okay, I don't know. Like my 14th fiance. Yeah. That's like, whoa. Okay, let's slow down, baby. Diff- that's different. Fiance is different. You don't think, you don't think, like, 10, her being in 10 relationships at the age of 20 is, or, or him even, like, whatever, either way, being in fucking 10 relationships by the age of 20 like serious relationships if I had all back to back girlfriends I would look myself in a mirror and be like something's wrong with you yeah you're that's, the problem that's all back to back you bro. that's what I would do it's true <laughs> yeah but I don't think it's like that big of a deal I'd be like oh it's a deal breaker it's not a deal not breaker, a deal breaker. isn't a red flag it's raising right? a red flag it's a red flag like yo I shouldn't be doing this <laughs> yeah a flag. it's a flag it's but it don't mean you're ending it right there oh my god I'm gonna cramp yeah, it's Maybe a yellow it's a card. Warning. It's a yellow card. <laughs> okay. Yellow card is a little... Yeah. Is a high relationship yeah. count a yellow card to you? Maybe a little bit, yeah. Which would you say is more of a yellow card? I don't think so because people, people meet people like maybe it was right at the moment then it wasn't. <laughs> Bro, we're saying <laughs> 10 relationships at the age of 20. <laughs> It's got to be all back I, to back. Luke what, has a point, bro. They got to be lined up. What isn't really Wait, good for me. <laughs> what would you say, Cynthia? <laughs> 
like question. if I had difficult to pick one. Question, huh? Difficult question. Yeah. You guys don't think? I it's, feel like it has mean, to be the high relationship. But it, I think it has to be. Relationship. If anything, it's gonna be the relationship. But yeah. I don't think either of them is a problem. You don't think either yeah. of them are a problem? No. You wouldn't like. You wouldn't like think like, oh, this. There's a reason why it's happening like back to back to back or anything like that. Like you wouldn't think like that. Or like you wouldn't think like, damn, this girl's been in like so many relationships. No, I'm different. I'm gonna be the last one. I respect it's that. Bro. It's just confidence. Carrie, yeah. which would you say is more Dude, of a red honestly, flag or more of a yellow card? It's a hard question, bro. Mm -hmm. well, I'm gonna tell you the truth, but um, if you had to pick one, tell me the truth. Dude, Luke, can you stop laughing, please? Thank you. Quiet on set, please. I'll, right. cut, I'll cut mics. Don't trip. I got you. Anyways, um, what I was saying <laughs> is, I mean, having a high body count, it's pretty tough, but like. In a relationship. I don't know why everyone's laughing. <laughs> <laughs> just keep talking. Just keep in a relationship, though, like having a lot of relationships, man, like, I don't know, man. That's tough, bro. That's tough. That's really Carrie, tough. Carrie, please one. make up your just, fucking Just mind. say it. There's got to be a goddamn. <laughs> hey, you guys know that one episode of The Office when Michael Scott's like talking to his fucking, <laughs> his boss, he's like, you know, you have to wake up in the morning and then, yeah. you know, what does he say, bro? He's like, he's like, and then. <laughs> I go put my suit on or something like that, <laughs> but not the wrong suit. I got to get the right suit. That's like literally what you're saying right now, bro. Just pick one. I'm indecisive. So, um, <laughs> sign. That's my sign. Yeah. Capricorn. Capricorn. I'm a Capricorn. You guys see Megan Second Fox Cap in MGK's interview? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dude, bro, honestly, Megan yeah. Fox is low key like a fucking wizard. Dude, no, wizard. I, I saw this comment that was like, Megan <clears throat> Fox was written by a man. And there was a reply that was like, Megan Fox wrote herself. I was like, that's so true. Megan Fox what herself? wrote herself like have you have you heard like that shit like oh harry styles was written by women uh no. yeah but it makes sense like, no no i understand yeah. so yeah. megan fox was written by a man well, i don't think so I, dude she's like crazy though i love megan fox. i love her too but you're like the way she talks and like the, like her energy i'm like oh my god i was watching uh cody co to talk about <laughs> megan fox did you see it yeah i was talking about cody co and one miller talking about megan fox and like I never see her, like her Instagram captions, and one of them they were like they were like roasting her about her like Instagram caption because she was saying like two lost souls. It was like a poem. Oh yeah, yeah she's like two lost Some souls. <clears throat> Wait, general okay. mayhem. I kind of liked the interview till I saw people roasting it. And I was like, damn, that's cringy as fuck. Nah, but it's cool though because they're like they're yeah, in they're, love and shit. Like yeah. no, they don't give yeah. a fuck. Yeah, that's why they're two dope people in a dope ass relationship. Do you know how Travis and Courtney got? engaged mm -hmm. yeah. i feel like it's because dude they're like trying to one-up each other all the time who them and like the, um, the kardashians no and megan fox is and mgk why oh because they're both like edgy white guys with like very sexy women i feel like the Wait, media courtney. compares them all the time yeah courtney and travis travis barker travis Bar oh travis mm -hmm. barker i think you guys are talking about travis scott bro mm -hmm. oh. i was like i was like that's weird yeah i was like what? you go with courtney Wait, where'd you where, where'd you read about? That would be funny. Or where'd you see where Megan? They said Megan Fox was written by a man. R written, right? It was a co it was a comment it was on a TikTok. Comment? Yeah, written by a man. And that man is Michael Bay. <laughs> 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 they, what was Michael Bay? Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> he was, yeah, he Michael was in Michael Bay Bay's went movie. To my school. <laughs> Your Belinda? That's sick. Art Center. Oh. <laughs> oh, I thought she meant your Belinda High School too. I was like, I thought he went to USC. Who went to USC? Someone well, went. To, was it Steven Spielberg? Michael Bay. Really? Yeah. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Where? Uh, how do we get on the topic Carey. of Mega Fox? Where, how do we get? How do you get on the topic of Mega Fox? I was talking about fucking. Bro. Oh, we were talking about that. Wait, how did we get we a Mega Fox? We were talking about, about the, the high relationship. Megan, baby, Meg the Stallion got a man. They were tripping on her yeah. because. She was up, Megan. Oh. Megan McGon. She's supposed to be yeah, hot girl, right? Just, she was just she, on oh. Hot Wings, bro. <laughs> She was supposed to be hot girl, right? Who the fuck? What? what the fuck are you talking about? Hot wings, hot girl. <laughs> Bro, she was she supposed to be just on hot wings. <laughs> can you? Can you? <laughs> Anyways, um, <laughs> you know that the yeah, YouTube channel? Yeah, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking yeah, yeah, Sean it. Evans. Yeah, spicy yeah, questions, dude. spicier answers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know what hot wings is. <laughs> All right, just making sure. Bro, uh, this man yeah, just yeah. fucking <laughs> like gave you the death stare when you interrupted him, bro. No, I don't care. I don't care. That's how you look at fucking girls when they fall in front of you, bro. Look, 
Luke, you look like fucking that kid from Toy Story right now. <laughs> <laughs> the kid that was like cowboy. Oh what's shit. The, that's yeah. Sid. What's the, what's the name? Sid? No, no, that's no, 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 no. Fucking Andy. You look like Andy. Andy. <laughs> 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 Not the new Andy though. The, the Andy they made fuck that looked like a fucking little like weirdo. OG Andy. OG Andy. OG Andy. OG Andy. Yeah, just Except w- you're kind of like <laughs> a taller version. And had a bigger head. Sorry, what were you saying about Meg? I'm sorry. Um. <laughs> so Meg posted a picture of her man. Mm-hmm. Her and yeah, I don't know who it is. You guys know who it is? He's a producer. <clears throat> Anyways, they're they're making fun of him because she was in a very like she was like hug. I don't know. Like it didn't seem like some hot girl mm-hmm. shit. And people were yeah, just, yeah, like hugging his cock. <laughs> She you was just it? like she was like bending over and hugging him like blah yeah. blah like, my man, mm-hmm. and then people were just like sick in the comments are like you're supposed you're supposed to be the one yeah you're the you chosen know, one you know when she was peak hot girl yeah. you know when she was peak like the peak hot girl Meg when fucking G Easy was licking on her oh, fucking God. nah that's no that was definitely a, a dip in the fucking <laughs> yeah you're not that was but not. she paid no attention to it this man was just licking her face she yeah she a hot girl she used to that so I'm saying that was peak hot girl Meg that was peak. that's not peak man peaks definitely when she was. <laughs> <laughs> no finish. I don't know when it was when she was dropping all her song. Body yaddy yeah. <laughs> that shit was crazy. Owen, <laughs> high relationship count or high body count? High relationship count. Okay, Lucas, you also said high relationship count. Body. Really? Really? Yeah, you guys are tripping. Ten at the age of twenty. Relationship. So what's the ratio? Let's say she started dating at the age of what, sixteen. No, what's the ratio oh. to to partner or partners and? Oh, like body body Either she has 10 relationships or she has 10 60. bodies. 60. 60s. No, wait. 60s. 60 bodies? What the fuck? Nah, let's say. 10 is a lot. 60 is fucking. 60 is way worse that's, that's, than 10. But 10 is a lot. Of, also, like a lot of relationships. That's half at the age my fucking 20. lecture hall right there. Oh, I thought we were talking about 10 body Ooh. counts or 10. Dude, there's guys with 60 bodies right now. Let's say she has Not me. 40 bodies versus 10 relationships by the age of 20. Dude, that's a lot. That is a lot. That's, no, that's crazy. That's insane. What's crazy? Which which would be more of the red flag? Relationships. Yeah. No. Yes. That's crazy. No. Yeah. Ten if you're in a, 20, if you're in a yeah. relationship. No. Yeah. Okay. Let's, makes sense. Let's yeah. put it this not, way. I'm let's not, put it this way. I'm not gonna be another stat. Let's, right? let's say she's had I don't relationships. Be 11. Let's say she's had relationships over the f- five years, right? Yes. All right. Start so at fifteen. Six. That's sixty months, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. And they said ten relationships. That's every each six relationship. Months. Let's say the average was six months. Yeah. Now and let's. That was, they, that's back to back. Yeah. Okay. Now let's put body counts. 40. So six. No, she said sixty. So sixty in what? No, sixty she months. 60. We said forty. Luke. That's fucking one per day. Lucas, no. think about <laughs> it. Not even close. <laughs> think about it. The it's, like eight, it's eight a month. Okay. Okay, I'm okay. thinking. I'm in, thinking. Just because you said think about it. Listen, listen, listen. In relationships, there's supposed to be like love and like emotions involved. Well, I can't speak on this topic, so let's go to the next one. <laughs> no, I'm trying to convince you. you. Well, I can't convince me if I haven't experienced it. Mm. Oh. Okay. Okay. Next question. I, I stand. <laughs> I stand by my answer. Next question. <laughs> Wait. So, what was the consensus? You're the only one that said. Sorry. You're the only one that said the body count. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Is following your ex. A red flag. Mm, no. Does he post sexy naked shirtless pictures? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Does she? <laughs> I would say so, yes. Okay, wait. I don't follow any of my exes, but I don't think it's a red flag if they do. What if they're, what if they're tight? Like friends after. Actually. That's a yellow. No. Yellow card. If they're, be- if they're friends, yellow that's flag. a red flag. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Wait, the, really? Okay, wait, you think okay. being friends with your ex? Wait, is a red I actually flag? have this question. So one of my exes was like hella tight. Mm-hmm. That's weird. With his girlfriend or ex girlfriend, and then like they still follow each other and shit, but she doesn't live in the state. What's hella tight? And they dated like years ago. What's hella tight? Like swiping on stories. No, they were like other. calling each other. Uh, no. When? Like wait, when you guys were together? <laughs> yeah, Dude, I as didn't soon know, as huh? soon as they, Okay, no. okay, yeah. So. But you didn't and know? If you don't know? Yeah, nah, I didn't know. I found something. out. Yeah. How'd you oh, find out? That's yeah. I like heard him. And While then, he was with you, he called his fucking ex. Whoa. <laughs> wait. Is, I think I think I think I brought it up. Luke, stop. <laughs> Wait, keep no, no, keep going, keep going. 
I like, I think I brought it up one time. And he was like, oh, you're tripping or something like that? Or did he understand? Actually, what the fuck are we talking about? No, you're talking about um, following your ex, like, is a red flag. Like, if it's a red flag and you said you don't yeah, find it a red, red flag. flag. Oh, shit. That. Actually, no, no, no. Following is not keeping in contact with them. Really? You don't, so you don't think flag. you don't think you can end end on good terms? So you can end on good terms, but like, why are you gonna what about? What? But like, you can catch up with them. Hey, you know what it looks like? You think catching up with your ex is actually no? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. This is tough. Hey, uh, you think what catching up? You think catching? Oh wait, no, 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 no. You think catching up with your ex is weird? Doesn't make sense. It depends if there was like some trauma or something, like something happened. Let's say no trauma. Just dated, had, like, feel, felt really close to this person, but y'all are broken up. And y'all go to catch up, and you're already in a relationship. Are we meeting up, like, to, like, hang out? Yeah, you're just, just going to grab dinner. Nah. Or lunch. I think that's, nah, if you're doing that while we're dating. Weird. While yeah, you're dating I think that's someone. Weird. I like, think that's why weird. are you doing that? Yeah, that's yeah. why. That's a red flag right there. So if you end on good terms. That's why I'm asking them. Respect my new relationship. Yeah, you got to respect the Well, yeah, you respect yourself, but like. But he, he had a good point. What'd you say? What if there's like trauma and like something like family or something like something happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like to go up and check on that person. Yeah, that's meeting up and with that, them. That's that not like sense. hanging out that's with them. That's not catching you know, up with them. That's you know, not catching up with them. I saw a TikTok where they interview older people and they asked the question, um, who's your first love? Right. And then they talk like, oh, blah, blah, blah. I met Susan, blah, blah, all this shit. And then these couples, this old couples getting interviewed and they were saying how your first love it's kind of hard to get over that, oh, like this. regardless. So what they do is they kind of accept that and they talk about it and they say, we like, I forgot exactly what she said, but she said, because they're both, we both had our first loves and it, w- it wasn't each other. Then we like give them a piece of our heart and we like sometimes, we'll like talk to them sometimes, but they're old. But I thought that was oh. cool. You're you know saying I mean? that they still talk with their first loves? They were saying something along There's the like lines. There's like a mutual yeah, agreement. Yeah, they, they, yeah. yeah. They, they both agree just oh. cause like their feelings are, I guess were so strong for their, their first love. That they're like they state the quote was like we both gave um a little b- uh, bit of our heart. Oh yeah, yeah. I like but that. I like that too. Not too much. Of okay, your but heart. this ain't. Hey, <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I said uh, a little bit, girl. <laughs> <laughs> How much you giving him? <laughs> a damn whole apple pie. You giving him? Hey, you giving him as much as as much? No, oh, fuck, I fucked it up. <laughs> as much water as Luke dropped on his pants. <laughs> That's not That's not fuck. Fuck. I fucked it up. Is it worse to a red flag or no red flag? <laughs> Sorry, Dude. man. You got me. Yeah. You got me tumbling you know about crazy. Yeah. Nick practices these questions in front of the mirror, and he still can't zoom. Really? I'm not gonna. Ha- I'm, this is the last time Luke comes on? on a podcast. No, what, I don't practice. What's them. a red flag? I'd probably practice them. <laughs> I've seen it. I'd probably say it a hundred times and pick the best one. Yeah, well, it still doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> Ask a question. So, like, let's say your ex girlfriend oh. has like some family trauma or like some like big shit that's like going on with her. Does this retain your life? Okay, listen to the whole thing. But you're in so it does. a committed relationship at the moment. Uh oh. And then but like your ex comes to you. Oh shit. And then you like accept her and then like listen to her without telling your current girlfriend. I think that's fucked up not to tell you gotta your res- girlfriend. You gotta respect the yeah. relationship you're in. Okay, yeah. and then so what if you do tell her? She says nah. She says No, and then you guys talk, but like isn't like accepting her in like step one wrong nah because especially if it's like a random call oh like and you don't know what's up like i don't know i feel like if, if is that like a thing if she if they like reached know. out to me like hey like i really need somebody to talk to blah 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 yeah. like, like if I'm, i knew she didn't have anyone yeah, yeah. I feel yeah. like if and i knew she, like, she didn't have she wanted to talk to me i'd be like hey honey i need to go talk to vanessa and then boom I wouldn't say it like that. I would like yo Vanessa. You gotta, you gotta make sure shit. it's cool. Would you say like, I I need like if you use I feel like if you use that word like I need to go talk to her like yeah that yeah, might be fucking weird. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it's be like, 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 ask, wisely, like bro. is it okay if I like? Would you ask though? Too? No, like, I, also, I would you know. Not, I would I, I would see why they would be apprehensive, but I wouldn't. I'd be like, listen, like she was really she used to be really important to me, and she's going through some shit. She just wants to talk to her. I'm just gonna talk to her. Blah. What if she does like lose her shit on you? Like, Your girlfriend? Yeah. Like, I'd be like, okay, maybe I won't talk to her. Really? <laughs> yeah. No, but like Same. you really do want to talk to her. Why? I mean, if mm. if she like if you put it like you asked yeah. and she really needs to, yeah. Yeah, if someone and, if someone needs something, no. then have her come over uh, and talk. No, no. No. 
Is, <laughs> well, he's got a point. Like, why, why, what, what, why, why can't the wife or whatever your significant other just be there and or be in the other room in the same house? You know, and just. Oh, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Know. I feel like I would agree with that. I would Hell be like, that's no. not about if, it. If my okay, it might sound like double standards. Well, no, I don't know. I feel like that'd be weird. Need to talk. If 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 my girl's ex came over and I'm just standing in another room, I'd definitely feel like a cut. Well, I'd rather do that than fucking meet her somewhere else, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like I don't know. It's hard. It's easier said than done, bro. It's not easy to just say like, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I'll call her. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. we live in a new age. Facetime. Yeah, there you go. Is it the same though? You know, not really. Let's give a call. What'd you say? I wouldn't Facetime. I'd call. You'd call her. Yeah, get some deep ass convos and shit. So if she says, if she texts you or calls you and says, hey, I need to talk, you know, like blah, blah, family traumas, um, I want to meet up. Would you guys say then, like, would you guys actually meet up with her? Probably not. Would you or just be like, hey, can we just call? Like, you know, I'm in a relationship. Yeah. Or I'd be yeah, like, I'm, I'm, like, I'm out of the country or some shit. I'd probably tell him like, yo, I'm in a relationship. I don't, I want to expect my girlfriend or not. Like, I can't be seen with you. No, like, <laughs> no, you just got to respect my girls i'm yeah. not gonna do that but i'll be there for you because you need someone yeah but you wouldn't would you go out and meet with her though if like if my girl like who i was dating was like oh go take care of that person yeah, yeah. If someone if someone needs help i'm not gonna say no yeah. okay so what if she says like oh why can't you just call her and i'd be like yeah that's a great idea and then <laughs> and then you just call honey her. yes i'll do that that makes yeah. sense okay yeah. i should just ask her when she called me the first time <laughs> What if, what if you're in public and you're with your girlfriend and you see your ex's family, like you're super close to them? What you, uh, you saying hi? Uh, yeah. <laughs> if, if oh, wait, you can, my I, girlfriend? Yeah, and you see your I ex's go, family. I would not go over and say hi. Yeah. And they're like, I don't like, know. I, if, if, like if, you're yeah. in line or something. And wait, like they're with right your by. girlfriend, current girlfriend. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that is kind yeah. of fucked up. I would not go like, Oh, yeah, that's my ex's that's my parents, mom. Though. Like, I don't associate yeah. my exes like, with their parents. Like, those are completely different people. <laughs> but, like, still. Yeah, it's not like they raised them or anything. There's, like, I'm saying. But they're like cooler than my girl. Of, like the girl. No, I feel that you can get hella close to them. Yeah. yeah. Did that answer your question though? About um. Actually, wait. Let me think about it. I'm so confused. What was your, what I don't was think I don't know if I'd go up to them, but like if they if they came up. You're talking about. Oh wait, yeah. Actually, it's not that weird. I don't Are you think still so. talking about the family, yeah. seeing the family in public. Okay. I mean, if you have like, if your parents, if their parents don't like you, then yeah, don't say yeah. hi. You guys are super like, close, though. They're like, then yeah, of course. Daniel. And they invite you. They invite you. They say, hey, you should hey, come, come over and come have dinner. Come to the house Bring for a yeah. sugar. Bring it in, son. You, you, you know, I love you like my son. The son I never would had. Would you introduce you your doing? girlfriend? Would you introduce your girlfriend to oh, them right there and then? Nah. You're like, Hi, this is my. I don't know because I I know some people. If I'm not my tight, friend, I'm not tight with the, with the family, then yeah. Because I've seen some people nah, where the parents cool. are like, yeah, like, yeah, oh, exactly. I'm so sorry, you and so and so to work out. Oh, nice. I, I've yeah. actually seen that shit happen. So yeah. what would you would you introduce? Like, would yeah. you be like, hey, wait here, and then go say hi to nah. the family, or would you be like, oh, come with me? Or like, me, I'd be like, this is Nick, or like, if oh, you wouldn't even say like, this is my boyfriend, Nick. I don't know. If you're that cool with them, I'm like, yo, this is my girl. I feel like I would be pressed if they were just like, oh, this is Nick. It depends. How far apart You'd be pressed. I'd be pressed. Yeah. Who's gonna say? Oh, this is this is a Nick. Yeah, you know. Yeah. If you guys ended on good terms, like I feel like a it'd be okay. If you guys end on bad terms, they'll be like, oh, oh. Like yeah. I saw like Mrs. Fucking so and so. So if you guys end on bad terms, oh yeah, I'm but not. You, but you were still brought up and you love the family. You know, the family loves you. Oh yeah, that's how. I, <laughs> I I started as like in a TV show or a sitcom or something when they break up yeah, and the guys like I, yeah. like they still hit up the the ex to go hang out like hey you should uh, you should come over man we miss you yeah <laughs> like they hate their what their, would you do if they hit you with that and your girlfriend's right next to you would you be like oh yeah or would you be like oh man I'd be kind of awkward yeah they shoot me a text Rob I think I might say something like that like yeah 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 because they're not gonna invite you over yeah like, they just saying that yeah. <laughs> they ain't yeah, gonna invite facts. you Nick wait what is that in yeah I, I've seen it definitely that's true yeah that's Sweet Life is Zach and Cody? No, bro. Oh. It's like right on my head. Adventure Time? Dragon Dome Peace. Is it a movie or something? <laughs> this motherfucker oh, said God. Adventure Time. Are there any parents in Adventure Time? Yeah, Lemonhead. <laughs> <laughs> He's a baby, right? Total Drama Island. Oh, man. Don't even get me oh. started on that emo girl. <laughs> What's her name? Gwen? <laughs> I Courtney, said, it's Courtney. I said we should do Total Drama Island. Cynthia, no, shut wait. the fuck up. No. Fuck oh, you. Be Owen? <laughs> Owen! <laughs> yeah, Owen can be Owen. Owen. Who would Daniel be? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I sent a Bro. group photo 
and the guy just happened to be in there. He's like, "Fuck you, Cynthia." Uh, I was like, what "Owen's the big, do? the big fat dude." Yeah. Yeah. And the blonde, the blonde yeah. hair. Yeah. She sent it. She's like, "Oh, we should you do this." Do and the I was like, hair. "Who the fuck you telling to, to be Owen, huh?" Throw some w- shade at me. I wasn't even applying. Oh, it. you, but the nerdy ass dude named Harold. That's Austin. <laughs> Harold with the glasses. Harold. Harold. Who, who would I be? Uh, you'd be the fucking you'd be the, host. the Rico Suave guy. Uh, he's like he's like he's like long hair. He's like he's like uh, oh, Hispanic. Yeah. Yeah, he's like, like that, we like his name Total Drama Island. Island. Alejandro. I've never seen it. What? You've never Alejandro? seen Alejandro. 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 Total Drama Island. Like, you should yeah. watch it. Honestly, it's in like a remember, cartoon. I don't remember. Fucking good. Did you guys I don't see like a cartoon reality oh game show? It's fucking good. It's it's good as fuck. You should watch it. It is. Did you guys see that clip of the new SpongeBob? What? No. You guys, it was oh, it was on Twitter. It was basically like a, like a thirty second clip of the new SpongeBob episodes, and it was terrible. Maybe I, I wasn't sure if it's because oh, I grew like I grew up. No, no, it was just like a new episode. Oh. SpongeBob tweet is like, watch our new episode is this it like Sunday. On. Shit? No, it's it's you can tell it's a little it's bit for art, but it's on Twitter. Yeah, but but Luke, it, have you seen the the SpongeBob anime? Oh yeah. <laughs> I watched watch that shit. Uh, did that answer your question though about meeting up with your ex? Or meeting up with AX when you're still in a relationship? I think so. Like, do, would you agree with us that there's, like, certain boundaries even um, if, like, yeah, you need... Yeah, yeah, there's just boundaries. I feel like there's still certain boundaries. boundaries that you need to respect. Like, when you're in a relationship, even if you're dealing with someone who has, like, traumas and they do need you, you know? Because, mm-hmm. like, we're not together anymore. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I shouldn't be the only person you lean on. Okay, wait, so would, you, would you, like, tell them about it before you make your decision? What do you mean, tell them about it? Tell them about what? Like, hey, my ex just contacted me unless she yeah. wants to like tell me over the phone real quick yeah like that's cool oh, yeah. if she tells me right there on the spot then i'd be like okay like what am i gonna so do if fucking she, say hold on if she doesn't then you're talking to your girlfriend about it first yeah if she's like hey can we talk later i'll be like i'll be like, like uh, can we meet up and talk yeah i'd be like uh you know what like let me find out if it's cool mercy you know yeah but if she just keep, if she just lays it on me like right there and then like hey can i tell you about this or blah blah, blah then it's totally different mm-hmm. one time my ex called me when i was out like with my other ex what? and i didn't answer no. and i was like yo guess who called me tonight Easy. and she was like who and i told her she was like why didn't you answer i was like i don't know like, she wanted you to an- she wanted you to answer like right there and then or what wait wait hold on if if a guy <coughs> doesn't answer that's way more sus if a guy doesn't if answer I'm with my ex? boyfriend and his ex calls and then he doesn't answer. I'm be like, "What the fuck? Why didn't you answer?" Oh, yeah. yeah. Nah, but really? you you're gonna get Whoa, mad either why? way. Yeah, 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 you're gonna get mad either yeah. way. Don't <laughs> <laughs> you lie to me, Cynthia? <laughs> even if it's the first time. Yeah, even if it's the first time. First time, first time like, you see that you name. Answer? Why did you answer the phone? <laughs> yeah, okay. Like, what if he says? What why don't you answer the phone? It's your ex. Yeah, and then if you don't answer, no, why didn't like, you answer? Huh? She, she wants to know, like, so you can't, like, hide it. Like, yeah, okay, okay, answer the phone. But honestly, so there's, no, there's no way out of what it, What if bro? he answers and says, that's all right, give me a second, he walks away? Oh, you. Whoa, he's that's like, a, I got to take this. Gotta, he's, yeah. like, he's like, I got to take this. Yeah. <laughs> that's the same thing as not answering. <laughs> so what am I supposed to do? Answer it. Nick, you can never answer win. Speaker, You're gonna, speaker, yo, speaker what's phone, up? yeah. Yo, what Don't is up? Don't even say I'm with my girlfriend. Just be like, yo, what's up? If he says that, be like, what the fuck did you say I have another question. Um... I heard that when your girl, like your girlies call you on FaceTime or something like that, and the girl points the camera at her boyfriend, they do that because they don't want the Ooh. girls to say anything. Yeah. Is that true? They don't want their girls to say anything stupid because oh, you're with him. Oh, that's happened to me, baby. Oh, are you still that? Oh. That's the thing. That's the thing. I, I thought they were just doing it just to be like, oh my God, that's look how cute I'm he saying. is. Same level. Oh, so it's a thing. It's or like I'm saying, that's the same thing as not answering the phone. I'm, but I'm asking you, is that a thing? I don't know. Like it's I wouldn't. Thing. It's a thing. It's a thing. It's a thing. Okay, if it's with a guy that I'm like, it's it's just a guy. I wouldn't do that with my boyfriend. But you do it with the guy to tell them, hey, like I'm with this guy. Like careful what the fuck you say. Well, like I'd be doing that too, but they just they're just better at it. Like we'd be fucking up sometimes. <laughs> nah, but yeah, girls be oh girls God. be doing that. So that's the thing. And they'll be like, oh, I'm with Mister Mister Mister. And then like, well, you can't talk about the other mister. <laughs> what if what if she didn't show? And she was like, oh, how was hanging out with Big Head? What would you do? <laughs> oh, at least she's hanging out with me. Or I'm like, there's there's a bigger one. <laughs> I'd be like, I thought I was the biggest. What if she calls you? What if she says I'm hanging out with Bigger Head? <laughs> Honestly, I'd be hurt because I take pride. Ain't no, no wait, Shorty got the biggest. I got I gave her the biggest dome. <laughs> it's the, it's the biggest dome she's ever had in her life. So I would tell her. 
<laughs> straight up. Okay. Last question, actually. Daniel sh- told me to ask this question. Yeah, I didn't tell you to ask Daniel a a- specifically asked me to ask not. this question. I said that's a good question. What's worse, your girlfriend having a lot of guy friends or her having one guy best friend? Neither. But I'm asking what's worse. Both. I Luke, am. Luke's cop. <laughs> that's I am the guy friend. And I'm I'm, not, I'm all her guy friends. <laughs> I'm, I'm all of those in the bug. Okay. I got a multiple if personality disorder, homie. We what's got a whole up, crew. baby? <laughs> Who are we today? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what's that movie called? Fucking Split. 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 Who's put on that dude? Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck him, go. What were you to say? If it is a guy best friend, oh. your boyfriend should like just be your number one priority. But like she can have a guy best friend. No. Sure. I'd rather have yeah. like a fun, fun, fun group of guys yeah, that she hangs out with. Yeah. Like she can step out with them. Oh wait, hold up. That's kinda She's only stepping out with them to, to parties? Like to hang out. Like Yeah, I'm not tripping about without that. him? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not tripping. Do I know them? No. Have I met them? No. At a, in a party setting. Ooh. I'd be tripping, but I think I'd be tripping out more about if tripping. she has a guy best friend than if she has a lot of guy friends. I'm I'd tripp- be tripping way Just more. Just thinking about, it, would you want want Neither. that for yourself? Like, if you're hanging out with okay. a bunch of girls, like exactly. What oh, if what if on her Snapchat yo, no. you're her best friend, but the rest of her best friends slash are guys? Dumb. Fuck that. All right. you guys no, are so you guys are so stupid and naive. That's you know? ass. Why? Wait, what? Why? Come on, bro. You're a guy, Nick. What do you mean? Wait, what did I do? Is I'm, it, I'm asking what's the lesser there, of two you think, evils. You think there's a such thing as a plutonic relationship? Yeah, but it's else? it's fucking. I'm telling you, it's a low ass percentage. No, I think it, you can't. <gasps> you true. can't. You can't have girl best friends, but you, I don't think a girl can be on the same level as your guy best friends mm. unless you're trying to like date. You feel me? Yeah. Because like yeah. we besties, but you ain't on the same level facts, as like facts. as like fucking Luke or Sean <laughs> or something facts. like that. You feel me? No, no, no. Facts. You got so what I mean? Fucked up, bro. Wait, that's true. I'm confused. Like our friendship. Yeah, not the same he, as Nick just said he doesn't yeah. fuck with yeah. you. What? No, yeah. that's that, not that, what I'm, I don't, I'm not with you on this. Uh, what's uh, what I'm saying? No. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what I'm saying? That's what am I saying then? What, what do you disagree oh, with? I totally you disagree agree. With? I totally agree what? with that. Okay, that's what I'm saying. Elaborate. I'm confused. So, if you say so, you know you have a lot of girlfriends, right? You have a lot of girlfriends. Would you consider their relationship main pro? Yeah, main priority over ours, like Nick. Like, would you, would you choose wait, them wait, over wait, him? Wait, wait, wait. Who are you closer with? You don't I'm have to I'm choose anybody. anybody. I'm not saying choose. I'm saying, I'm saying, like, to like, like, I'm telling them shit. I'm not telling you. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's what yeah, I'm I don't saying. tell you shit. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. But they're my girlfriends. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. They're my guy friends. But I'm gonna. Yeah, that's different. It doesn't have to be telling. But that he's saying, that he's saying he doesn't agree. That with doesn't that. qualify it as a. Uh, more important just because you tell them. Yeah. Like, you know, like that doesn't mean it's a okay. more important relationship. Okay, like, I think so. Why wouldn't you not tell the other person that? Because this is how it is. All my, if, if I no. said all my friends are the same, I'd be fucking stupid. Okay, all my relationships are the that's same with that's everybody. That, that, you're dumb. It's a fact. There's no way. I have different. I honestly think I have different, unique relationships with everybody. Okay. Yeah. And I'm not going to yeah. tell so you the same thing. You're, you're telling like imagine certain I, people. Then. So, so imagine you had something in your life and you told That's every, what I'm all saying. I'm telling certain people too. Though. Yeah. Wait. That's what we're trying to say. You know, Carrie's like the first person I call to tell anything. So like if I don't know if I'm gonna tell people like I always tell Carrie, I don't know why, <laughs> I don't like I have no trust that he's gonna keep it into himself, but I still do because like I love telling I him, Carrie. I just love telling him stories <laughs> honestly like, uh, uh. and it's funny when like just me and him know shit and we just laugh. Dude, I can't tell you how many times, bro. We we like tell stories of past times that just make us laugh till this day. Like, it's just it's so funny. I don't know. Yeah, hilarious. Hilarious. Wait, Wish so you were here. What are you saying? I'm on confused <laughs> now because what I was trying to say is I was just gonna say like, unless oh, I like here. a girl a lot or I'm so? trying to get at a girl who's my best friend, I don't think a girl would ever be on the same level oh, as my sure. guy best friends. Is what I'm trying to that's say. That's what Luke's saying. Uh-huh. That's what. That's what. I, yeah. So yeah. That's what I'm saying. So He's just saying it more like, like. He's telling his like we we all have like unique yeah. relationships, so he's telling like a like a select amount. Like, yeah, but like what Luke was saying, it's not it doesn't always apply to just tell it. You know, like yeah. we could like even if we're kicking it or like doing something, Valid. it's not going to be on the same like, level as like a girl. You know, like yeah. we can we can sit down and probably like watch a movie or do something stupid and not say a fucking word. Mm-hmm. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like that's mm-hmm. like you know, and it's not fucking awkward, right? If I sit down with like Cynthia or like Mario, I'm probably gonna want to like talk. You know what I mean? Facts. Just just. Cause I want to talk, Facts. you know what I mean. But sometimes with you guys, I just, we just sit in silence and eat. 
You guys hear me chewing with my mouth open. I do that with my girlfriend. So what I'm saying, like that's what I'm saying. Now, if it's a girl though, like that's what they're talking about. If I'm like into the girl or something like that, or like You're gonna it's more than platonic, I'll probably like I could probably sit in silence with them. You know, this. I, don't know, I feel like I could sit in silence and watch TV with anybody. I can't. Like, I I get I get like nervous or something like that or like fucking. No, no. Let's watch TV. What was the original question? What was the original question before we had on this tangent? Which did you? Which is worse, a girl having one guy oh. best friend? Or a bunch of guy best friends. Or a bunch of guy Sorry, friends. I say the same thing as last time. Uh-huh. Both, both of them are as bad. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, Daniel was saying how if you can have a platonic relationship, yeah, but it's very, it's not, it's, yeah. it's not, it's pretty rare. Cause I, get, I get what you're saying. <sighs> most of the girls I've been friends with, I'd be like, I might have, like, I'm like, okay, well, you're cute. <laughs> I'm cute. <laughs> we could be cute together. You could have some cute kids. No, but seriously though, like yeah. you as like like no agreed, guy, no agreed, 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 agreed. Like, okay, agreed. I've thought, had like yeah, thought, yeah, yeah, agreed. Definitely, agreed, agreed. I, the thought crosses I think your mind more than it ca- crosses girls' minds. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, totally agree. I think there can be platonic relationships, but it's hard for it to be two sided. What's platonic? Yeah, because somebody somebody's gonna fold. <laughs> I mean, they just want to be friends. They're not attracted to each other. What's a platonic? It's, it's when like it's like a guy. Just like, like just wait, like what? I'm talking. No sorry, sexual, sorry, sorry, sorry. Go ahead. No, oh. no sexual. Or like intimate. Yeah, no sexual tension. Not attracted to each other. Just friends. So you and me, sometimes. No, but it doesn't that. apply to guy and guy. The platonic's usually just. Look, it could. Like so just a regular though. friendship, not like. Yeah. 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 But no exactly. intimate matters. Yeah. Exactly. How many how many girls are you friends with that you're like never like. Like, if the opportunity was in front of you, would f- you hop on? I have yeah. a few from high school, but, like, we haven't talked since because, like, you Ooh. know, it's it's not going to go anywhere, you know? But if the no. opportunity was in front of you, is like what I mean. Like, a about girlfriend, that's no. just you're such your a liar. friend. Yeah, yeah exactly. You're such like, a liar. I've had friends in high school that we were just homies, you know? Like, we are just, like... But what about now? So, but, like... Now, no. Okay. Because we're so not, I'm not in high school. if the opportunity presented itself, you would say yes. Uh, shit. Might depend on the girl, bro. <laughs> See, so that's not platonic. <laughs> See, yeah. I'm not saying so that <laughs> makes sense. Yeah, I feel yeah. like I feel like some like. Yeah. There's just uh, vibes like guys. Yeah. Guys aren't as platonic as they say they are. Yeah, I can agree with that. Yeah, yeah I think girls are a lot more platonic. Yeah. Yeah. For yeah. Sure. yeah. 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 yeah, which kind of sad. Because we're all fucking guys, though. It's kind of so sad, bro. Why is it sad? Uh, 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 Carrie's in the friend zone. Deep in the friend oh, zone. Oh, Carrie's mm-hmm. friend zone <laughs> master. <laughs> <laughs> My boy be catching TDs in there all the time. <laughs> hey. He's the gatekeeper to the friend zone. <laughs> My boy, the, the WR number one, <laughs> what's huh? That, hey, what's that meme? What's that meme? Like, That's true. I lead others to a treasure that I cannot have. <laughs> 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 Anyways though, hey we can we can wrap it up from there though. Alright, we out. Alright guys, this is gonna be a wrap. Thank you for tuning in. I'm your host, Nick Herheda. It's your boy. Ow, ow. <laughs> ow, ow. Owen Miller. Uh Carrie, guys. Yeah. C Breezy. And this has been Total Drama Island. The 40 year old man, Daniel Fabris. Woo! And I'll see you next time on Rancho Boys. Remember to watch out for your guy best friends. Um, Watch out for your exes. Uh, Watch out for your boyfriends and girlfriends. Uh, Watch out for Carrie Martin in the streets. Barnacle Boy. Always use protection. Peace out, guys. Stay safe. I put my dick in a bag of Doritos. Look out for Carrie on the streets? Yes, always look out for Carrie on the streets. Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> my dick. Yeah. RIP yeah. Betty White. I know she ain't dead, but time's <laughs> <laughs> Damn that shit tight. Let's go. Come on.